Hello Aries, welcome to Beauty 2 Tarot and this reading is from 8th of October to 14th of October. So let's check what are the messages for you. Messages for Aries. What's coming towards you? Sun. Ace of Wands. Seven of Cups, Five of Pentacles in reverse. So I think Aries here you might have a third party situation. Maybe there is someone in your life or something in your life that is being an obstacle in your relationship. Okay, so if this person is, you know, um, interested in someone else or they are seeing someone else and you feel like that this person is ignoring you and um, somehow this third party has become priority for your person, you know, it's not the truth. Here you see Seven of Cups. It's your illusion. Aries. Maybe you are not looking at the complete picture you are not aware of what's going on behind the curtain and uh, there is a lot that is hidden from you because seven of cups is about something that you cannot see everything seems so fine on the surface on the surface okay you might be looking at this person and you feel like that this person is really happy with this third party but this is not the case these two are getting through a lot of issues okay so you know here you have ace of wands if you felt like that this person hurt you and they walked away and there was no karma for them there was no justice for you and um, you lost faith in faith in the universe maybe so it's time to see what's happening okay I'm not saying that you should go and find out what's happening in their in their life, but uh, if you get into details or if you are in touch with someone who is a mutual friend, you will come to know what's going to um, what yes what they're going through and what's happening in their life. So your wishes are being granted. Maybe you were desperate for justice, maybe you were asking for justice and you felt like that this person uh, just walked away happily after hurting you and uh, you couldn't do anything. You know, you just don't need to do anything, Aries. Okay, the first thing is that you just don't need to do anything at all. The universe knows everything and uh, on the right time, everyone gets what they deserve. So, Ace of Wands is bringing you whatever you are looking for okay and above all you have the sun here but rather than focusing on what they're going to focus on the sun you have here a lot of happiness is waiting for you in this week you might meet someone new you might come across something that you always wished for and your wishes are granted here the sun is bringing a lot of warmth a lot of happiness try to embrace that try to focus on your own life because there is a lot to do. Okay, and the universe is offering you a lot. So, basically, the tarot is telling you that this third party is already in trouble. Your person is in trouble already. And maybe this person can ask for help. Okay, this person might ask for some kind of help. But I don't think that this person is going to open up clearly. You will come to know what they're going through. Through their body language, through their words, through their actions, and you will have this idea that why this person is here back again. Okay? 
However, this is a general reading, of course. This is not going to resonate for everyone. And energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon in the rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Messages for Aries. The High Priestess in Reverse. Ten of Swords in Reverse. Seven of Wands. Okay, here we have Four of Cups. So here we have mm, the High Priestess in Reverse. I think a lot of things are coming in the light. She will come to know what uh, their situation actually is and what this person is going to. And uh, I think that Aries. It's because the universe wants you to move away from this. Okay, maybe you have spent a lot of time in this relationship. You have put a lot of energy into it. You have already put a lot of effort into it. And uh, still, if it doesn't work, that is not your fault. Okay, do not try to stick too hard to something. Do not try to hold the sand in your hand. Because uh, somehow you are losing control over it. And the worst thing is that maybe you are losing your peace of mind. So here the universe is telling you to move, Aries. Do not fix. Do not get uh, fixated at a point. And um, Ten of Swords is about letting go of the past. It's about letting go of the pain. It's about uh, letting go of the jealous. Maybe, maybe you were jealous. Okay, you were feeling like that uh, this third party has become priority for them and this person is not interested in you anymore. But things are different. You don't need to get, you know, so desperate about this whole situation. And here you have seven of wands here. We stand up once again. Fight once again. You can do anything that you want to. And you have this courage to get over anything. Rather than, you know, crying over this spirit cup, look at the three that you have. You have much more. Much more to handle. There is hope. There is the sun. There is warmth. You are amazing. And you definitely deserve better. You des definitely deserve more. So, you know, Aries, Aries, it's time to move. Finally move. Maybe you are... Uh, stuck here for so long and uh, now the universe is telling you no you cannot do this okay so something might happen that will compel you to move from this relationship you might discover some ugly truth about this person and you will feel like no I don't want it anymore or I don't want to be treated in that way so this is a reason why this person was uh, doing it all this person was interested in this third party. And now when they're done with them, they're again back. So it's about a game maybe. So I think that you'll be done. You'll feel like that uh, I just can't handle this kind of uh, person and uh, I don't want this in my life. Something like that might happen. Okay? Let's check an oracle message for you. room what dreams may come from what you seek make room make way a clearing need be you need to clear something you have got this broom you need to clear your mind you need to clear your heart you need to clear the negativity around you so whatever you have dreamt of is coming towards you and uh, this is what you were actually seeking subconsciously you wanted something better and uh, if you want that make room for that Okay, make space to accommodate this blessing that you're going to get. So this was the reading for this week of October. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Till next video. Bye.